Romance. We're going to turn to romance, are we not? Anybody interested in romance? Romance. <laughs> romance. Actually, we're actually we're going to give this kind of a little different different title. We're, I'm going to call it love pain, even though that's not necessarily the way you put it. Mm-hmm. Okay, but it, one of the centerpieces of it is is having been in a relationship and it faded for whatever the reason. And in your terms, you ob- you, you obsess about it. Mm-hmm. That's the that's the, t- yeah. the term you use. Uh, are are you comfortable just you know kind of giving a background on what's going on? Well, there are two. I- obsessed on, but one of the most particular men I've known for 21 years that I spent uh, time with this summer. I hadn't seen him in 10 years. And um, there was a hope for me that there would be a change. It was that he never wanted a committed relationship. I always did. And it was clear at the end that he still didn't want that. And I haven't heard from him. It's been over a month, mm-hmm. even though he promised to keep in communication. I As you talk about that right now, are you getting an emotional intensity? Yeah, yeah, it was sadness. Uh, uh, give, frust- me a, give me a number for it, could you? Well, it's about eight. I would oh, about say. an eight. Yeah, mm-hmm. How do you know? Are, are you getting some signs in your body, uh, chest or... No, I or closed my eyes. I saw the number eight. <laughs> you saw the number eight. Yeah. Okay. Okay. All right. But it's, yeah, here I feel in here kind of uh, familiar, kind of in my throat, kind of uh, sadness and uh, tightness here. And, uh, I wonder if that's because your energy depression. system gets disrupted. Well, it makes I, sense. I, I, don't, I don't know. Yeah. <laughs> well, I think so, but I don't know. It's a disruptor for sure, yeah. yeah. I key into that. Yeah. yeah. Well, you have a thought about that. Mm-hmm. In your term, you obsess on it, which means, it, which means you think about it with some consistency, I guess. Yeah, mm-hmm. I do. It's like, you know, think of an incident, time we gather, well, what if only this had happened instead of this, or, or it, pain. It involves a lot of pain and frustration. Pain in what way? Um... Well, in terms of an of an expectation or a wish that was frustrated, or a sense of a, being abandoned, of being uh, lied to, or uh, hopes coming up and then hopes being lost, that's more mm-hmm. the pattern, yeah. Okay, do you hear several aspects? Mm-hmm. Okay. Uh, b- and by the way, that doesn't mean that we necessarily have to deal with all the aspects. Sometimes we'll just deal with the general thing and pfft, all the trees fall down with one fell swoop. Mm-hmm. That does happen. We don't know that. But anyway, so there was the, the one gentleman to whom when you, when you dwell on it, you get to an eight, at least you did yeah. at the moment. There's another one? Yeah, well there in the interim, let's see, in, uh, let's see, two years, about a year and a half ago, a relationship ended, ended that was short, it lasted a year and a half, that also where, it, there was an explosive incident at the end where I discovered he had been deceiving me for a long period of time. I hadn't, I denied the clues. And uh, so after that, uh, how does it feel you know, when you say he was deceiving me? Say he's, he deceived me for a long period of time. Say that. Yeah, that that's really strong in the chest, strong anger and pain and. Uh, okay. Yeah, that. Um, it's like an infidelity or something like that. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Uh huh. Okay. Mm-hmm. Uh, I just didn't. I just hadn't imagined it that yes. would be possible. Yeah. Yeah, and that I much less imagine that the relationship could be cut off immediately after that because he, he said, well, I'm not monogamous. He never told me that, and uh, that you know I, I have to have uh, more than one lover at the same time. That it was totally new to me. And um, is that what number is that when you talk about that? Uh, Besides the fact you moved your feet when you said <laughs> it. Okay. <laughs> yeah, that that's pretty strong between about nine, I would say. Okay. Well, okay there, are, okay, there are at least a couple of issues that have several pieces to them that yeah. we're talking about uh, that, that you tend to obsess on, yeah. if you will. It tends to occupy mental space, causes yeah. you emotional difficulty, mm-hmm. um, and it'd be nice if you were free of that, sort of like sure. Margot and her freeway driving yeah. and so on. Sure. Okay. Uh, I may have uh, my test for psychological reversal on that because it could well be persisting. Oh, it probably is. Well, we'll, we'll get in. We'll All I want to do is set the stage right now and kind of understand what's mm-hmm. going on yeah. and, and that kind of thing. Um, is, uh, is it helpful to dwell on this? Well, rationally, no, of course not. Oh, okay. Yeah. All right. Okay, so rationally, but emotionally, somehow there's a emotionally need. Emotionally, it persists. It's obsession, obsessive. Sure. Okay. Mm-hmm. Um, all right. Um, I wonder how we would address this. Gee whiz. Uh, 
let me see. I wanted, I wanted, which of, uh, when we talk, which of all of those issues you were talking about was the, do you have the strongest emotional reaction to? The infidelity? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. Uh, say he cheated on me. Mm -hmm. Say that. He cheated on me. How did that feel? Yeah. Tears in you, you know. oh, okay. All right. All right. Okay. Even though he cheated on me. Even though he cheated on me. I deeply, profoundly accept myself. I deeply, profoundly accept myself. Again, even, even though he cheated, he cheated on, on me. I deeply and, and profoundly accept, accept myself. myself. Even though he cheated on you, you can accept yourself. It's okay. That was his choice. <coughs> even though he cheated on you, you can accept yourself. <coughs> even though he cheated on you, you can accept yourself. He cheated on you. 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 Put your arm for me. He cheated on you. Is it any different? No. There's no different. No. Oh, okay. All right. I'm gonna I'm gonna rub the source pot. Okay. Is this it? Yeah. Okay. Even though he cheated on you, you can you can accept yourself. It's all right. You can deeply and profoundly accept yourself, even though he cheated on you. Can you say it okay? Even though he cheated on me, you can hum it if you want. Cheated on you? He say, say he cheated on me. Brings up embarrassment and shame. And yeah, but okay. Now wait, wait. Your embarrassment and shame. You're shifting aspects on me. Okay. But I just say that I'm just reporting that that's what's coming up. Yes. Yeah. Okay. All right. Mm -hmm. See, what, what, what's, when she says embarrassment, and was there something else before that, like anger? Yeah. Okay. Originally, we were talking about anger. Uh, sadness, although I didn't ask her about that, it was a mistake on my part. Okay. Sadness, anger. Sadness, it's anger. All a bundle. Okay. Yeah. Okay. But my guess is what was happening originally we were going to sadness and anger, which would be like your headache, so to speak, and then the toothache and the stomach ache is now coming up, which is embarrassment and shame when we're doing something with that. Yeah. Uh, I want you to, just to test for the moment, just say this, he cheated on me. He cheated on me. Now, how does that feel? If, if it was a 10 originally, what, what is it now to say that? Maybe a 7. Maybe a 7. Yeah. Okay, even, even though I still have some of this cheating on me problem left. Even though I still have some of this cheating on me problem left. I deeply and completely accept myself. I deeply Again, even though I still have some of this cheating uh, problem left. No, I still have some of this. Okay, now what's coming up now? More tears. Yeah, more tears, but give me a word for the emotion besides tears. Grief. Grief. Yeah. Is it embarrassment? Well, it, it's connected with that accepting myself. It's like when I felt by him uh, love, by him to discover was not. Okay. Mm -hmm. okay. Even though I have a problem accepting myself. Even though I have a problem I deeply and myself. profoundly accept myself. Deeply and profoundly. You don't have a problem accepting myself. I deeply and profoundly accept myself. Even though I have a problem accepting myself, I deeply and profoundly. You don't have a problem accepting myself. Even though I have a problem accepting. I deeply and profoundly accept myself. I deeply and profoundly. Self acceptance. Self acceptance. Self acceptance. Self acceptance. Again. Okay. So he cheated on me. Cheated. How does that feel? Better. Okay. So, now, I want to zero in on one thing. I don't know if we've got it all, but I want to zero in on embarrassment yeah. and shame. I want you to think about embarrassment and shame. That's what we're going to zero. If you happen to find yourself shifting, mm -hmm. stay back on embarrassment yeah. and shame, okay? But I think you got it really with that self-acceptance is kind of what key did I? the whole thing. And the whole okay. Yeah. Okay. So we, what we did was just cut the top off a number of trees. Maybe. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah. But we're not done. Yeah. I know that. Okay. Yeah. All right. Yeah. But I want to go back to embarrassment and shame, okay? okay? I want to stay right on that okay. aspect of it, okay? Uh -huh. Is embarrassment and shame the same thing to you? Yeah. Because let's just call it yeah. shame. It's yeah, easier shame. to say. Yeah, okay. Shame. All right. All right. Say, uh, I accept myself even though I have this shame. Accept myself. I have this shame. Accept myself even though I have this shame. Accept myself. You can accept myself shame. even though you have this shame. It's okay. One more time. Accept myself. Even though yeah. I have this shame. shame. Okay. This shame. 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 Any better? Oh. Are you shifting to a different scene? Well, no, it's just more intense, but I think the intensification is good. I think it doesn't mean that it's, <coughs> yeah. it's intensifying, but okay. it's... Uh, but, well, but I want to know what's going on in psych because you were shifting for me from embarrassment and shame to, you know, anger and stuff, well, and shame to... You know, I realizing it was shame as we were doing it, the intensity of the shame, I was realizing it. But if you'll just continue, I think you'll go down. Okay. Yeah. Remaining shame. 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 Remaining shame
remaining shame. Remaining shame. Remaining shame. Close your eyes. Open. Hard down right. Hard down left. In a circle. In a circle. Yeah. Other way. Happy birthday. Mm -hmm. One, two, three, four, five. It's better. It's down. Okay. Five. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. Okay. Remaining shame. 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 What is it? It was three and then it went to four. Yeah, it's better. Okay. Three went to four. So it's going up or down? Went up a little, but it's it's kind of vibrating. Okay. Uh, what was so shameful? I think it, it has to do with uh, not having a relationship for so many years and having one suddenly and then having it end so abruptly. And it was embarrassing to me that he was... Embarrassing among other friends you have to tell about? Uh, yeah. Embarrassing societally? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yes. That's the only embarrassment there? Otherwise it was no other part of embarrassment? Well, it was shame to me in terms of I thought that we were so intimate, that was so honest and so... Um, deeply involved and that uh, that was the deceit going on that I didn't see through the deceit. So you have shame because you didn't see through the deceit? Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. Okay. Seeing through the deceit. Seeing through the deceit. Seeing through the deceit. So you just listen to people. You just, you just tap for whatever phrase you want to pull out of it. And that, see, I don't even know if I'm doing this right, as a matter of fact. I'm just asking your yeah. questions and we're getting, we're getting some stuff on the surface and we just start tapping for it. Are you feeling better generally? Yeah, it feels better. Mm -hmm. Okay. Um, why is it your fault, the deceit? I mean, if he was, why is it your fault you didn't see through it? Well, I can see why I denied what I could see or didn't ask questions or didn't, you know, because I was afraid of losing the relationship, afraid of abandonment. So it was a yes. fear of abandonment was greater than my willingness yeah. to see. Yeah, abandonment. Fear of abandonment. Even though I have a fear of abandonment. I deeply and profoundly I accept myself. Deeply profoundly accept myself. Yeah, yeah. If I have this fear of abandonment, I deeply profoundly accept myself. I have this fear. Yeah, I deeply profoundly accept myself. Okay, fear of abandonment. That's fear. a strong one. Yeah, That's fear of abandonment. I know, I can tell. Fear of abandonment. Didn't fool me. Fear of abandonment. <laughs> fear of abandonment. <laughs> <laughs> no humor, you know. <laughs> By the way, you can do humor. You don't have to sit there and be heavy all day long. We're just still tapping out on the energy system, you know. Okay. Remaining abandonment. Remaining abandonment. Remaining abandonment. Remaining abandonment. Remaining abandonment. Say I was abandoned. How's that feel to say? Give me a number. About ten. Oh, it's about a ten. Is it a different aspect to it? I was coming together in both those relationships. Well, you bring the other relationship into it. Now you got yeah, abandoned twice. Together, okay. Yeah. The second abandonment. The well, second abandonment. Abandonment number two. Abandonment Whatever. number two. Abandonment. I hope I hope you're recognizing, Marlis, okay. that uh, this bit about about we be shifting aspects is happening with you because yeah. you're going from one to the other Sorry, to the other to the other. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. But I just want want you to notice. Because you're, you're doing it in spades, and it's a great teaching thing. It's helpful for you, et cetera. Because yeah. what you're doing is you're just jumping from place to place to place to place. Uh, I hope you're, are you recognizing that? Is it obvious to you? Right. Okay. Um. All right. And see, if you if you weren't aware of this aspect thing and jumping around, you'd be dealing with somebody or yourself or yourself or somebody else, and you'd say, "Well, they're not getting any better because they're reporting they're not fitting." Can we have a microphone for Chris here for a second? I think that that was what was confusing me about when we were talking earlier about using generalizations versus the laundry list. Mm -hmm. And, and um, it seems like so many of these issues have different aspects. And it seemed like one of the things Adrian was saying earlier is a lot of uh, kind of general things will, will cover the... the the, yeah, the various yeah. aspects. And, and when do you decide um, to go into those aspects? And it will depend upon how artful you want to be. That's why we have the courses part one and part two. I'm, I'm not only talking about the concept here, but the art is, I'm doing art to it now. And I'm finding <coughs> aspects and I'm pointing them out to you and I'm pointing them out to her and so on and so forth. Uh, she could as an alternative to this, although it would take longer and it would be less obvious to her about her change, etc. And she may not keep on with it because of that. Do what I said this morning, and that is every day start talking about these general issues. You know, even though I have this this relationship, you could call it a relationship issue. Yeah. Da, da 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 da. 
no pain whatsoever or minimal pain probably because uh, you don't know what your subconscious mind is bringing up and you just keep doing it and after a while I mean, you, will not, you will no longer obsess okay so there's two ways to do it but I'm showing you the art to it which if you want to master this at all you need to get into it some okay how you doing? Better, thank you. I'd, I'd uh, like to work more on the abandonment. It's about, it's down though, maybe four. It's four. Yeah. Okay. I think well, it says deeper, deeper roots, of course, than these relationships. But those are the most intense at the top. Yeah, I want to right now. I want you to stay on those relationships. Yeah. Okay. Now, if you shift, just tell me you shifted. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> and that's okay. You can shift, yeah. but I, but I, what I'm trying to do is is to get a single isolated issue down to zero. Yeah. And then if we can't, that's another single isolated issue get down to zero. Yeah. That's cutting down some trees and then noticing if the whole forest falls. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah. Um, which would be interesting if we could yeah. pull it off in the next 20 minutes or something. Yeah. <laughs> Whatever it is. Okay. Um, or it's about the abandonment for the moment. There was an abandonment with one gentleman and then you brought the abandonment with the other one. Yeah. And that bothered. So, yeah. so I guess we were, I'm guessing we were addressing the one and it seems to get better. Then the other one comes up and now that just... Yeah, they kind of flip back and forth. Yeah. Okay. Well, we'll just cover them both at the same time. That's and if right. it doesn't work, we'll try something else. How I long does it take? Hardly any time. Yeah, right? I can keep them both in mind at the same time. Okay. Mm -hmm. All right. Double abandonment. Double well, abandonment. Even though I've had double abandonment. Even though I've had double abandonment. I deeply and profoundly accept myself. I deeply and profoundly accept myself. Again. Even though I've had it's more than double. It comes triple, quadruple abandonment. <laughs> Will you stay on double for me? Okay. Okay. <laughs> okay. Whatever you want to do. Go ahead. Triple, <laughs> quadruple. We'll look, we'll deal with the whole thing. We'll do the whole thing. All my, ab even though I've been abandoned many, I've been abandoned many times, yeah. I deeply, completely accept myself. Deeply, completely accept myself. Again. Even though I've been See, we don't have tears now, do we? I deeply, completely accept myself. Go ahead. Even though I've been abandoned. Ah, here we go. Deeply, completely accept myself. All these abandonments. 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 Okay. Remaining abandonments. Remaining abandonments. Remaining abandonments. Remaining abandonments. Remaining abandonments. Um, as we were doing that, and we started to get tears on the third thing, what was coming up? Just seeing a lot of them running together, kind of, you know, self-pity or um, grief. Yeah. Okay. Now, grief is a different issue than abandonment. Well, it it stimulates grief to be abandoned. It's it mm -hmm. stimulates grief to be abandoned. Is it yeah. the same emotion to you? Yeah, abandonment's not an emotion, but grief is. Okay, grief. And, okay, is grief and abandonment the same issue to you? Well, abandonment can have many emotions attached, okay. but grief was coming okay. up. Okay, say I was abandoned repeatedly. I was abandoned repeatedly. How does that feel to say? It's better. It's better. It's, I mean, it sounds even a little funny. <laughs> so it's, uh, yeah, maybe uh, five. It, not quite stable. You okay. Fix it you will hear this sometimes. Yeah. There's a real shift in attitudes. Mm -hmm. she, she laughed about it a little bit. Okay. Mm -hmm. now, is it funny? Well, maybe not. But you can laugh. You can see some yeah. humor in it. Yeah. Since you couldn't see humor before. Attitude shifts. Yeah. See, when you no longer have the going on about things, mm -hmm. the attitude automatically shifts mm -hmm. and you will, you will perform and behave differently in, in the world around you. It happens with business all the time. Um, you know, people with sales get more successful. Mm -hmm. Do you hear me? <laughs> Talking to some of our salespeople, you know. So it's about a four. Even though I still have some of this, ab all this abandonment left. You know, I still have some of this abandonment issue, left. abandonment issue left. I deeply and completely accept myself. I deeply and completely accept myself. Again. Even though I still have some of this abandonment issue left, I deeply and completely deeply accept myself. myself. Oh, got a picture of my mother then as a baby. Okay. So, yeah, it's better though. Okay. Yeah. One more time. Even though, I still, Even have though I still have some of this abandonment issue, I deeply and completely okay. accept myself. Okay. So you have another aspect, her mother, mother and the baby, or mother as she was a baby. Okay. Remaining. Remaining, remaining abandonment. Remaining abandonment. Remaining abandonment. Remaining abandonment. Remaining abandonment. Are you still four? So that was abandoned. Maybe three. Yeah. Okay. Remaining abandonment. Remaining, remaining abandonment. abandonment. Remaining abandonment. Say I was abandoned. I was abandoned. By my mother. By my mother. How's that feel? Uh, two and three. Between two and between three. Between two and three. How would it be ordinarily? I was, were you abandoned by your mother? I mean, I guessed that from what you said I, earlier. I concluded I was. I wasn't 
physically been a cult owner. Well, who you who were you abandoned by, besides the two gentlemen, and perhaps your mother? Um, and other other relationships, other people I felt. It's kind of a blur, but that's just what's central now is the okay. being an infant feeling abandoned when I cried. Mm. Oh, okay. Infant abandonment. Infant abandonment. I was I was abandoned when I was a baby. It's abandoned when I was a baby. Again. It's abandoned when I was a baby. It's abandoned when I was a baby. Abandoned My mother didn't love me. My mother didn't love me. That's it's stronger. My mother didn't love me. What here's stronger? Here or when I, I said my that? My mother didn't love me, yeah. Okay. Mm. Say it and tell me what the emotional intensity is. My mother didn't love me. That's oh. eight. That's an eight, okay. Even, I'm going to say it, okay? Even though your mother didn't love you, it's okay. You can accept yourself. Even though your mother didn't love you, it's okay. You can accept yourself. Even though my mother didn't love me. You deeply and profoundly accept yourself. Okay, one more time. Okay. Your mother didn't love me. 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 If you can laugh at this one, then I... Mother didn't love me. Remaining 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 mother didn't love me. Okay, look at me. Close your eyes. Open. Hard down right. Hard down left. In a circle. Other way. Happy birthday. Okay. Just be quiet a minute, okay? Just let me talk. You ready? With me? Yeah. Okay, is it still the same scene? The same item? Okay. Even though, your mother, even though your mother didn't appear to love you, it's okay. You're here now. You can deeply and profoundly accept yourself. Even though she didn't love you, that was her choice. Maybe she didn't love anybody. You can deeply and profoundly accept yourself. Even though your mother didn't love you, you can deeply and profoundly accept yourself. Your mother didn't love you, just be quiet. Your mother didn't love you. Okay, your mother didn't love you. Mother didn't love you. Mother didn't love you. How are you doing? Are you it's ten? All right. It's all right. I'm working it through. Are you ten? Nine. Eight, eight nine, ten. Did it come down from that? Yeah. Okay. The, re the remaining of the mother not loving your problem. Remaining problem with the mother. Remaining mother love. Remaining mother love. Mother didn't love you. The remaining problem. What are you now? You're up there. It's like, yeah, yeah. It's just like confronting it. You, when you said it to me, it's the first time it ever really came to me. I mean, it never, okay. it never yeah. came to see, me. Now we're, see, we started off with obsessing about some gentlemen. Yeah, okay. but this was the root of it. Yeah, yeah, okay. Root. Well, yeah. okay. maybe it is, maybe it is, and that's just where we've come, okay? <laughs> I'm going to do this, by the way, just because we haven't done it before for a reversal. Yeah. And maybe for her, there's something about this meridian that would be useful. I'm just guessing, okay? Mm -hmm. Part of the art of it, I guess. Even though my mother didn't love me, I deeply and profoundly accept myself. I accept my because of this. I don't know. I just okay. suddenly felt more of my All right. higher self. There. Okay, I accept myself. I accept myself. Even though my mother didn't love me. Even though my mother didn't love me. I accept myself. Even though my mother didn't love me. Okay, mother didn't love me. 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 By the way, I want to point something out to you. Is, is I was tapping here, I just at, at the point we had, hadn't even tapped yet. Yeah, right. Remember I talked about for some people, you have your point? Mm -hmm. Well, we have a clue here. That might be your point. I don't know. Mm -hmm. I mean, this could be your point. Because something was happening and you felt a release at the moment. Or it could have been just the process. Could have been the process. Mm -hmm. I'm just looking for clues. That's all. Maybe I'm right. Maybe I'm wrong. Who knows? But, yeah. but uh, we're looking for clues in that case. But if it's consistent, hey, you know, you get a clue. How are you doing now? My mother didn't love me. Say that. My mother didn't love me. What's the number? Five. Five. Yeah. Remaining pro remaining mother didn't love me. Mother didn't love me. Remaining 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 mother didn't love me. Is there still a five? Remaining mother didn't love me. My mother didn't love me. Say that. See, it better. It's good for me to say it publicly. You know, my mother didn't love me. My mother didn't love me. My mother didn't love me. How does that feel to say? good. My mother didn't love me. 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 
What kind of a woman doesn't love her mother or her, her daughter? I'm speaking to that with you. Um, a woman who doesn't feel loved herself or who doesn't love herself either. Mm. See, I didn't ask her about her attitude to begin with about that. I don't know if that's what it would have been. Mm -hmm. Was it anger before? Toward my mother? Yes. Oh, it was um, grief. Yeah. Okay. I don't know if we had a shift in attitude here because I didn't see the before. Yeah. But this is an interesting way to have it come out after all of this because it's a very healthy attitude. It's someone who didn't love herself or didn't have love herself yeah. or something. Yeah. Right? Okay. So my mother didn't love me. My mother didn't love me. How does that feel to say? It's better. It's yeah, because seeing compassion for her too helps. Um, it's about three. It's okay. getting yeah. Re remaining mother problem. 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 I'm gonna put this back up on your up under your arm and say remaining mother problem. Remaining mother problem. Remaining mother problem. There's still a two or three. Uh, Just a minute, we're going to do this again. My mother didn't love me. My mother right didn't love me. My mother didn't love me. My mother didn't love me. <laughs> yeah, my mother didn't love me. <laughs> <laughs> Can we have a hand for her mother, please? <laughs> There's a release happening. Okay. Um, it's like it's bringing me closer to myself, my real self. It's like... It's almost like it was a long trial or to bring me to, a, yeah. um, in, to myself. In conventional, some of the conventional psychology techniques, um, they, they talk you through all this kind of thing. Instead of tapping your energies, and they talk and they talk yeah. and they talk. And have you done that before? Conventional. Could you just hold that up and speak into it? It'd be easier. Yes. Yeah, you've done that before? Conventional? Yeah. Um, 20 years of it or more. Oh, 20 years of it. Oh, okay. <laughs> All right. Yeah. As, as a matter of fact, you used to work for, for a firm that, that specializes in trauma. I think it's the same firm that Marjorie... Yeah, I was the director there at Medical yeah. Psychology Center, Middle Park. Yeah, yeah. okay, yeah. good. Good. Um, um, conventional techniques might, might draw a parallel between the fact that your mother didn't love you and that was your perception, you were abandoned and so on and so forth, mm -hmm. and saying that the thing of the gentleman you're talking about was simply a replay of that and the fact that they behaved a certain way triggered the one thing yeah. once upon a time. Would, would that be accurate, do you think? That's exactly it. That was okay. the core, yeah. I don't know if that's true or not. That, that, that is the way uh, other methods would go about it and, it and they certainly have their effect. Well, it doesn't matter. The theory doesn't matter. It's just that I followed my process and I reported to you my process and that was my process. And yes. this is my healing, you know. Yeah, okay. So. My mother didn't love me. My mother didn't love me. <laughs> <laughs> didn't. Is that okay? Yeah, it's okay. Yeah, it's okay. I mean, I'm at about a one or one or two on that. Okay, my, my mother didn't love me. My mother didn't love Remaining me. Remaining problem, mother didn't love me. Remaining mother problem. Remaining mother didn't love me. 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 Your meaning mother didn't love me. I'm going to tap here just because we did once yeah. before and it seemed to work. Meaning mother didn't love me. Okay. Meaning mother didn't love me. Okay. Didn't Say it love seriously. Meaning mother didn't. <laughs> <laughs> no, I, I'm, sorry, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. <laughs> Say it seriously. Your <laughs> meaning mother didn't love me. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So your mother didn't love you? It, that's a lie, actually. But uh, <laughs> <laughs> after all of that, <laughs> <laughs> after. <laughs> Like all human beings, we love each other. Sometimes, sometimes we don't, you know. But there were just some. Keep it up. Yeah. Um, she loved me as best she could. And don't we all do that? Yeah. Love each other as best we can. And don't we have to all fight with our own little things within to love somebody else? And what are those tears about? Well, it, being human and that being a human condition. You know? Okay, but am I looking at another aspect of something? Because mm -hmm. it looks to me like you've got some more emotion going. Uh -huh. Am I right? Well, it comes to do with, I see my own attitude that I have a kind of a perfectionism expectation of people that they should love ideally or totally instead of humanly. It's kind of bringing up sadness about my ways of relating expectations and love with people. And oh, okay. Mm -hmm. Well, we're going to need to break, I think, for lunch in a minute. Yeah, that's right. uh, we could go on and uh, uh, yeah, yeah. Uh, However, I, I you know, with this issue, without having the kind of pain you've had, you can mm -hmm. still do this every day, like we talked about. Yeah. Or uh, you can you can you know master this yourself and start getting to all the little issues if you want to. Work mm -hmm. with somebody else who wants to master it and, and that kind of thing. You know, yeah. I mean, you have some other people well, you work with. Well, it was a wonderful with. breakthrough. Thank you. I'll was it? Forget this. All right. Good. Yeah. All right. Go thanks. Can we have a hand for Marnie?
Give me a hug, would you? Okay. All right. Um, See, so you, you and I had never met until here, but you and I talked on the phone. A lot, yeah. Okay. Or I wouldn't have made it here. You wouldn't have made it here. Okay. How do you feel right now just about sitting here? Are you well, anxious? I was thinking that this is working because we, I, just till about a minute before you said, I wasn't even nervous. Mm -hmm. And even though I knew that I was going to come up here and do this. And that's a, a shocking. Okay. Well, how are you now? I'm nervous. Okay. <laughs> Give me a number. Five. A number five. Yeah. Okay. Say, say this nervousness. 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 Is this still a five? Oh, two. Two. Is it two? Okay. Remaining nervousness. 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 Remaining nerve. Remaining nervousness. Okay. Yeah, it's good. Is it good? Yeah. How do you know it's good? How's the heart? Do your hands sweat it's, or something? It's, or? It's, I get all, I'm not that. That's what I do. Okay. Rip things up and napkins. All right. Yeah. All right. That kind of thing. Okay. Well, if you get that way, you'll let me know, okay. won't you? Okay. Okay. All right. Let me see. You have a number of issues, and, and some of them stem from once upon a time. I remember you told me on the phone that you had the unfortunate circumstance of having your mother pour, pour boiling water on me. Pour boiling yeah. water on you. That's called rejection, I guess. Called bad mother. Called bad mother. Yeah. Okay. Right. Okay. And that has evolved into other issues. What do you want to What do you want to work on up here? You told me uh, before, but um, um, I'm I'm afraid of being touched. And even when my son hugs me, like when he goes back to college, I go like that. Okay. So if I were to get out of this chair and come to hug you, would you resist that? I wouldn't like it. You wouldn't like it. You know when they used to have all these everybody all hug and everything. Uh -huh. I call them mandatory group hugs. I'd be like, oh, get me out of this. Get me out of this. Yeah. Oh, oh, get, what happens to you physically if somebody tries to hug you? Do you get heart pounds or you get no? I, I actually go. My whole body goes like that. Uh -huh, yeah. Okay. And that's limiting for you. Oh yeah. Yeah. <laughs> okay. So if I were to get out of here and go hug you on a scale of zero to ten, how tense would you get? I, I wouldn't like it. Maybe a seven. Maybe a seven. Yeah. Let me give me a try. Okay. How did that feel? No. Is it a seven? Yeah, or it was a seven. It was a seven. Okay. All right. See, I'm not going to do anything to make you uncomfortable. I just wanted to test it for a minute, okay? So I had mini yeah. discomfort. Okay. Just mini. Okay, I'm going to test it around. Yeah. All right. Okay. Uh, what do you think that comes from? I'm asking for your, for your intuition. Not to disrupt your body system. In your body system. I want to know. Past wise, well, what you think may contribute? She didn't just pour boiling water on me. She she beat me all the time. She beat you all the yeah. time. Yeah, with the hairbrushes. And, and you and think that's why you, you? Yeah, that's why I'm afraid of touch. I, that's what I think. Oh, okay, that's what you think. All right. Uh, if we're to deal with this, are you are you likely to have tears about it? Oh yeah, I bet I would. Oh, you bet you would. Yeah. Okay, tears about what? When, when Veronica was, I had tears for when Veronica was having hers, her okay. issue, because it because she said the person who's supposed to take care of me. Uh, Violate, you know. Okay. It, it, so it's trust. Okay. Now, how are you doing? Okay, but I'm okay, scared. This, this, this anxiety. 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 How is it now? Okay. Remaining anxiety. 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 Okay. Now, please notice, if you will, on this particular, we haven't done any reversal yet, have we? And she's she's tending to respond reasonably to it. I mean, yeah, we do well, that. So feel good, though. Okay, yeah. so we haven't we haven't had to worry about reversal so far. So it's a little shorter way to do it. Took less time. You know, I just tried it. Reversal at the moment doesn't seem to be in the way. Okay, so uh, so your inter system responds nicely because the bowling pins are already set up. And we'll see how that is when we go on to other things. But just speaking about some of the issues about the you know, the past gets you a little anxious. This well, anxiety, by the way, was not had to do with just being up here like the first one was. No, no, this, this is all of that, because it wasn't just her, because then I thought that was love, so I, I, had, my, I had a lover who almost killed me, and then I still have, um, cycle, I have pain from my neck being damaged, fr from being badly beaten. He would take Madrone, piece of, he tied me up and take Madrone and beat me with a big Madrone, kick me and beat me and wrench my arm. So like, even like right now, I mean, I, I like all, some, all this, Winter, I was in. I was paralyzed by pain. Yeah. You want to keep your hand yeah, away from the microphone? Yeah. Okay. I should know that. <laughs> okay. Paralyzed by pain, but then it came, is it come and go? Um, it, it lasted for months, and then I. But it has been trying to come back. Okay. Is there pain in your neck right now? 
In my shoulder, yeah. In your shoulder. Yeah, and, and I thought it was just related to cold weather, but it's damp okay. weather, even the fog. So. Oh, you're sure about that? Well, so on a scale of zero to ten, how intense is it? It's about a seven. It's about a seven. Yeah. Okay, I want you to move it without damaging yourself. Take take your own responsibility, okay. but move it to a point where you know you get a seven or eight or whatever, so you can recreate it later on. Okay. There it is. Right there. There it is. Real okay. Bad. I couldn't do that one where you were doing that. It really hurt oh, to do okay. that. that time. All right. So that's a seven or eight doing that. Yeah, that's okay. Right. I just want to do that for a minute. Uh, and I, I tell you why because mm -hmm. we want to minimize pain in the whole process. And she has some things that to her are very painful. You can cry very easily. Your legs shake and everything else. So I'm going to deal. And this is just my choice. Okay. There's no magic formula here. I'm just going to deal with the pain here, suspecting that there's probably some emotional component to that and we'll just see we're going to start in with that okay and it's easy to deal with some kind of physical pain to begin with anyway okay so I want you to say pain in my arm 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 okay raise your arm for me pain in my arm okay all right I just want to check it out move it up and tell me if it's still a seven or eight or whatever that number was it's it's about a six it's about a six okay remaining pain in my arm remaining pain remaining pain in my arm remaining pain in my arm remaining pain in my arm Remaining pain in my arm. Remaining pain in my arm. Okay. Remaining pain in my arm. Okay, good. Check it out again. Oh, it's about a three. Okay, remaining pain in my arm. 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 Remaining remaining pain in my arm. Check it out. It's about a one. It's about a one. Yeah, we'll do it again. Remaining pain in my arm. 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 Check it out again. Oh yeah, good. Well, raise it even higher. Is there a way you can do that without hurting yourself, or where you normally couldn't do that at all? It's very hard. Yeah. It's a pain here. Uh, yeah, it's still. Okay, well, give me a number for for that pain. It's about a four. It's about a four. Okay, remaining pain in my remaining arm. Remaining pain in my 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 arm. I want you to do the nine gamma. We haven't done that yet, so do the nine gamma. Let's tap on that. It's right there. Tap there. there you go. Okay, tap there. Now well, here, uh, I want you to do it vigorously like that. Can you okay. do it like that? Like that. Okay. Okay, close your eyes. Open. Hard down right. Let me do it for you. Okay. okay. Hard down right. Hard down left. In a circle. Other way. Happy birthday. Mm -hmm. One, two, three, four, five. five. Happy birthday. Mm -hmm. Okay, remaining pain in my arm. 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 Okay, lift it up and tell me how it's doing. Oh yeah, it's better. Well, better or what? Yeah, it's just about gone. Just almost. It's gone. Okay. Oh yeah, good. Well, you know, what's interesting to me is you were telling me it comes and goes with the winter and the. Yeah. Okay. I think it comes and goes with your energy system being disrupted. The only way I can tell you that is because all we did here was just balance an energy system and it went away which is very it's a point I've made before but I want to emphasize it again whenever we get anything whether it's emotional or physical down to zero if you notice it coming back see first of all when we got to zero by my definition it is cured that is there's no trace of it at the moment the beauty of that definition is that when it does seem to come back you need to notice what's going on in your environment that caused it to come back that and be specific what cause what in my environment may have disrupted my energy system and caused it that it might you've learned it might be a toxic substance you might have eaten something or, or, or something like that you know you might have smelled something and that's what you want to be aware of okay because all we did here was just that we didn't do anything else so it has a big emotional component to it doesn't it yeah. how's it feel now it feels good okay how do you feel just sitting up here a little nervous a little nervous it's, it's how about the how about the shaking yeah the well it's the tightness it, it's it's hard to talk about this because it's embarrassing. Okay. Yeah. Oh, there's some embarrassment about it. Okay, yeah. that's a different issue than the subject itself. Okay, this embarrassment. And this embarrassment, this embarrassment, this embarrassment, this embarrassment, this embarrassment, this embarrassment, this embarrassment. Okay, remaining embarrassment. <coughs> remaining embarrassment, remaining embarrassment, remaining embarrassment, remaining embarrassment, remaining embarrassment, remaining embarrassment, remaining embarrassment. Okay, now first of all, I'll tell you, uh, uh, one of the things you can do here to get aside from any embarrassment you want, you don't have to talk about details. You can, if anyone points to that would be embarrassing, I want to talk about that detail. Okay? And we can deal with this with just you knowing what it is. However, that's more difficult to do because I've got to make sure that I keep your thinking in a, in a certain place so that we can do all of this, you know, uh, keyed into one thing and so on. But you have the right to say that's, that's embarrassing. Okay? Well, I, 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 
knew it would be, but I want I I, I need to change this. Okay. Because I mean it's terrible. Okay. Well, but, but I want you to know is that you don't you okay. do not have to crash through a bunch of fear. We have time to do this. Okay. All right. Because yeah. I I don't even think I'm worthy of your taking my time uh, taking the time for my okay. problem. So because that's what? all part of it. Because I didn't I wasn't worthy to be loved by my own mother. Oh good. Yeah. And so if I come up to hug you, you're not worth that. No. Okay. Yeah. All right. <sighs> Well, what if I think I'm worth hugging you? Okay. <laughs> okay, that's all right. Well, you know, I'm an academic. Okay. Well, we'll see what happens. We'll see what happens. At any rate, at any rate, um, if I just had the term boiling water. Uh, oh, yeah. Well, on a scale of zero to ten, what did that do to you? A ten. A ten. Yeah. Okay. I'm going to say well, I'm going to say boiling water. Okay, because I don't want you to get too involved with it. Boiling water. 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 Okay. Remaining boiling water. 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 Okay. Now, boiling water. Uh, how did I didn't get the initial intensity? Assuming the initial intensity was a ten, just for a benchmark. It was, if, it, yeah. if it was a ten, what, what would it be now? Boiling water. It, it's a five, but I'm mad. But you're mad. Yeah. Oh, okay. Now, at first it was the boiling water, now you're mad. We have yeah. a different aspect. Yeah. Okay, mad about boiling mad. water, say it. Mad about boiling water, 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 mad about boiling water. Okay. Remaining anger. Remaining anger, remaining anger, remaining anger, remaining anger, remaining anger, remaining anger, remaining anger. Okay. Boiling water. <coughs> Give me a number. Three. A three. Yeah. Are you mad about it, or did you shift to something else? I'm, I'm, um, I don't know why she did it. I'm mad. I, how could she do that? How could she do that? I don't know. But what I want to know from you is, because yeah. I wasn't there. Yeah. She tried to stop. She threw it on me and she tried to stop so it oh, hit this arm. It would have hit me all through the, and yeah. I went to the hospital but nobody cared. Nobody cared. Because everything looked so good, you know, nice house, nice everything. Nobody cared. 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 Okay. Boiling water. You say it. Boiling water. Boiling water. She she threw boiling water. She on threw you. boiling water. How does that feel to say that? I hate it because my daughter says I have to forgive my mother if she's going to forgive me because because I was so crazy. I had her early childhood was not good. So she's she's going to. Your all mother's early childhood was not good. My daughter's. Oh okay. My daughter's uh -huh. because uh -huh. um, I I was so crazy because I got with this crazy man. My daughter was with me, and he, she, they say it's, seeing your mother abused is just so bad for mm -hmm. a child. Yeah, sure. And he abused her a little bit, too, physically. So, um, and then she ended up being sexually abused by a neighbor, which I didn't know. So I have all this terrible guilt, and she mm -hmm. says, so she said, she's made a contingent. That, you know, and like, at some level, she doesn't believe that my mother, because she met my mother, and my mother sort of like, quit being so bad, but my brother blew his brains out on Mother's Day, so she was a very toxic mother. Mm -hmm. Yes. Yes, and so, but, my, but she fooled everybody. Well, and your daughter wanted you to forgive your mother. Is that yeah, good advice? Yeah, or she won't forgive me. Is that good advice? That's just how she said it. She's a Taurus, okay. and I've got to do it, and so I've been trying to do it, and I don't know how to, I don't know how, I don't to, know how to do that. No. Forgive my mother. Oh. By the way, we have different Forget aspects here, don't we? Forgive, Forgive my, my mother. mother. Forgive, Forgive my, my mother. mother. Forgive my mother. Forgive my mother. Forgive my mother. Forgive my. Forgive my mother. Okay. Yeah, we may not have complete forgiveness in 20 minutes or 20 seconds or whatever. But, but do you think it's possible to ever forgive someone for that? I, I, I just don't know. Well, who pays for it if you don't? My daughter and myself. Mm-hmm. Okay. And my son. But, yeah. Does your, mother, does your mother pay for it? No, she's dead. Okay. So there's no way she can pay for your lack of forgiveness, <laughs> right? And the only, per the only person who takes who gets advantage from that is you and your daughter and your yes. son and your husband, right? Yeah. Okay. All right. It's just perspective. Yeah. Okay. By the way, for those of for those of you who are people helpers and therapists in the room, you might notice is is this perceived the difference in cognition that goes on the way she talks about it and that kind of thing. Okay. Especially around forgiveness. Is your mother worth forgiving? Well, I wouldn't do it if my daughter didn't demand it. Uh, Let's okay. put it that way. Okay. Because I just I I cannot intellectually, or emotionally, or any other way figure out how to okay. forgive her. Did your mother need help? Oh yeah. Mm -hmm. 
and no one helped. She never okay. got help. Okay. All right. Save this. Okay. My mother threw boiling water on me. My mother threw boiling water on me. On a scale of zero to ten, what does that do for, to you? Still ten, back up to ten. Oh, back up to ten. Because I'm mad. But you're mad. Yeah. Okay. Are you mad at something different than we were the first time? No, I'm mad at her. You're mad at her. Yeah. Okay. Anger about anger at mom. Anger at mom. Anger at mom. Anger at mom. Is that what you called her, mom? Yeah. Anger at mom. Well, tell her what you want. Yeah. Anger at mom. All right. I tried not to talk to her. Anger at mom. Anger at mom. Anger at mom. You're still at ten. Oh, down to two. Remaining anger at mom. Remaining anger at mom. She threw water on me. She threw water on me. Remaining anger at mom. She had no right to do she that. She had no right to do that. Remain, remaining anger at mom. I was mom. just a little girl. She, I was just a little girl. Remain, I didn't do anything remaining wrong. Remaining anger at mom. Remaining anger at mom. Well, how is it now? Well, I really think that I'm vindictive and I'll never change. Okay, but all I want to know <laughs> I is know. all I want to know is it well, it maybe maybe, but what I want what I want to know yeah. is this. Uh, when I say your mother threw boiling water on you, what does that do on a scale of zero to ten? Um, it's better. I mean. Okay. Now let me point out. You may maybe you're so vindictive you'll never be able to change, yeah. but you can do this. Can you not? Yeah, I can. Okay. That's good. And you can say my mother threw boiling water on me right. and and not yeah. get angry. And we've we've only taken did, yeah. seven or eight minutes or whatever it is. Right. Okay. So I know maybe you can't change all this. I know that's, maybe that's impossible, but I I'm want pointing to. out maybe there's a step or two in the right direction. Just I want, want to stop it. I want to stop it. Okay. <laughs> yeah. I mean, okay. I'm being facetious right no, now. Is it really possible? Do you think it's really possible? I mean, is it? Well, it doesn't seem possible to you. Yeah, it doesn't. It does to me, and I'm only pointing mm. out that we've done a little bit. We've, we've made some steps in the right direction because you were able to have some reasonably calmly say my mother threw boiling water. Say it. My mother threw boiling water. My mother threw boiling water on me. Yeah, it is better. Okay. And my arm is better. So. Yeah. Okay. And it, it, what number do you give my mother through boiling water on? Down to two. Down to a two. Yeah. Remaining, remaining Remain anger at mom. Remaining 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 anger at mom. Okay. My mother threw boiling water on me. She had no right to do that. I was just a little girl. Say that. My mother threw boiling water on me. She had no right to do that. I was just a little girl. Now say she needs help. She needs help. Yeah. Oh, there. Oh, there what? There, that's it. She, <coughs> see, I took it as me, something about me. That oh, okay. She, but so she you, needs help. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Well, perhaps. Yeah. Uh, I, I want those to be your words and not mine. She I just have to throw them out. Does she need help? Yeah. Does somebody who throws boiling water on a child for whatever the reason need help? Yes. Anybody? Okay. Yes. Do they need forgiveness? Maybe a saint could forgive them. Are they worth forgiving? Maybe not. Maybe not. Okay. Okay. Why would you? Why would? A, why would somebody like your mother throw boiling water on you? Because she was so angry at her, 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 her how her life was going. Okay. So she had a great deal of anger. Didn't know what else to do with it. So yeah. she, among other things, threw boiling water right. on you because you happened to be in the way. And right. And because I was born and got in her way. Yeah. Okay. What a what a shameful thing for you to do. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Um, and I was smarter than she was too. She oh, hated that. You were smarter. Uh, yeah. Okay. Okay. Um, on a scale of zero to ten, how reluctant are you are you to have me come over there and hug you? Ten. A ten. Yeah. Okay. Reluctance for hugs. 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 Okay. Yeah, let's do the nine gamma here. Okay, look at me. We talked about reluctance for hugs. Close your eyes. Okay. I'll just say it for a moment. Eyes hard down right, hard down left. Reluctance for hugs, and then roll them in a circle. Happy birthday. Reluctance for hugs. 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 Okay. I wouldn't mind it. You wouldn't mind it. On a scale of zero to ten, what is your reluctance to have me come and hug you? It's down to a two, and and I it's down to a two. And I kind of want it in a way so that I can get some some movement on it. Okay. Now, but I want to draw a distinction. Okay. If I can, what I don't want you to do is say I'm going to need to confront this. And go through whatever discomfort there is to have Gary hug me, so okay. I can somehow get beyond this. Yeah. Okay, that, we don't need that here. And, and and if you have to have any of that feeling, 
and that is conquer your fear, so to speak, then this process is not being done properly because you should be totally and completely free of that. That's why I didn't have anybody touch a snake until they felt they were ready to do it. I didn't want them to crash through some fear and some barrier, etc. So, now, tune into yourself and, and be very clear and congruent about the number. What is the reluctance you have for me to get out of this chair right now and come over there and hug you? It's a two. It's a two. Okay, remaining reluctance. Remaining reluctance. For hugs. Remaining reluctance 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 for hugs. Okay, now, what's the reluctance right now? I think I could do it. Is it a zero reluctance or you have some and you think you could crash through it? I think it's a half. I think it's a half. Yeah. Okay. Could we get a, 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 a microphone to Ellis? Gary? Gary, yeah. yeah. Then we would know. I, I, I think I could. Okay, well, it, that's another way to test. What if Ellis wanted to come up and talk to you? What if he wanted to come up and hug you? Um, yeah, he, he's Are you been sure? giving me water for the last two days. Okay. <laughs> Good water. <laughs> All right. Well, I'll tell you what, I, I'll tell you what, here's what I want to do. I'm going to get up here a second, and, and uh, no, not yet. I'm, I'm, I'm going to try it first. I mean, the guy wants a hug, doesn't yeah. he? Yeah. Okay. Okay. But you see, you see, now, now Kathy is not academic. So I'm going to come over there and hug okay. you. Okay. Okay. But I'm not going to just run over there and hug you because I'm concerned about your reaction about it. And there's no need to take a big lot of time about it. Okay. So I'm going to ask you again. You know, I'm going to come over there and give you a hug. I'm going to do this. Okay. On a scale of zero to ten. Three. Three. Okay, so you got some going, okay? Yeah. Okay, Re remaining reluctance to hug. Remaining reluctance to hug. Remaining reluctance to hug. Remaining reluctance to hug. Remaining reluctance to hugs. Remaining reluctance to hugs. Remaining reluctance to hugs. Remaining reluctance to hugs. Okay. So I'm a little closer to you. Take a look. Okay, I'm going to give you a hug. It's better. It's yeah. better. Is it, what number is it? One, it's a half. Okay, I'm going to stand. I'm just going to, I'm still going to hug you, but I'm going to stand yeah. closer. Now, the mere fact that I'm standing closer yeah. and I'm in your space. Yeah, and, that's scary, but. It's scary. Yeah. Okay. Uh, uh, oh, well, and we're feeding but, back. Yeah, but give, uh, okay, but give me a number. Give me a, give me, <laughs> give me a number on the scariness that I'm in your space. Um, it's a three. It's a three. Yeah. Remaining scariness. Remaining scariness. Or just scariness. call it scariness. 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 Okay, now say this. You're in my space. 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 Okay. All right, put it down. Bring your arm for a second. It's better. It's Go great. Way up there, okay? Way up there. Oh, great. Is it? Okay, yeah. good. All right. All right. Because, see, I did this to fend off blows of the, of the Madrone and stuff. Oh. So, that's where And that's where you get the pain? Yeah. I get oh, that's know. interesting. That wouldn't be an but emotional connection, I'm sure of it. Yeah, right. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, here I am in your space. It's not bad. It's not bad. No, usually but, I'm well, what I'm going to do is I'm going mm. to put my hand on your shoulder okay. as though I'm going to start a hug, and I want you to know what that feels like. Is that? Oh, it feels good. Does it? Yeah. Okay, now if I put it around here, how's that? I like it. Be, be, be yeah. clear on it, though, no, okay? I, am, I do. Okay, now I, I'm going to give you, I'm gonna okay. give you a hug, because I think you're ready for it. Okay. okay. Are you ready? Okay. okay. All right. Oh. Right. Oh, no. I want you to stay right there. Okay. 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 I'm going to speak into these microphones. Okay. And we're deep, we're like this is so California. I can't believe it. So California. But I want to know on a scale of, z on a scale of zero to ten, on a scale mm. of zero to ten, how do you feel right now about this hug? It feels good. Does it? Do you like it? Except your square is scratchy. No, that's okay. I'll tell, you, I'll tell you what. I'm going to stand up. I want you to stand up, and we'll, we'll hug standing up, so we, we can do it more comfortably. Are you ready for that? Yeah. Okay. Go ahead. All right. Hey, put your arm around me, like that. Oh. There, there, there we go. There I haven't had much practice. You see, this is this is one of the one of the joys of doing this. Mm. You know, you get hugs. Oh, pat me mm. <laughs> you like that? I do. Is it okay if Ellis hugs you? Yeah. Are you sure? I Let's like come it, up, yeah. Ellis. All right. Come, <laughs> I can't believe I'm doing this. Yeah, I know. Well, I know. I know you told me a minute ago it was impossible to do it. I know. But I just don't okay. Anyway. Thank you for bringing that breed of water. Oh, my pleasure. All right. Thanks. Oh, yeah. Thank Thank you. Thank you for wanting to do it. Mm, thank you. Here's what I'd like to do. Thank you very much, Ellis. Yes. What I'd like to do, only if you're comfortable. Okay. And you tell me if you're comfortable or not, okay? And you'd be very clear on it, because I don't want you to crash through any barriers and that kind of stuff, okay? I thought we'd go down there. We'd just go down the aisle, and if anybody wanted to hug you, they could. Okay. Well, no, no, wait a minute. I saw a bit of... No, no, no. Okay, well, but, but give me whatever number that was, okay? Um, it was a 
was a four. It was a four. Yeah. Okay. A resistance to people's uh, other people's hugs. A re resistance to other people's hugs. A 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 resistance to other people's hugs. Are you still a four? I'll be clear. No, I think I actually wouldn't mind it. Okay. Yeah. Well, let's go down, but we're going to okay. do it very slowly, okay? We're not going to make any big deal of this. I mean, even gonna... holding hands is hard, so this is good. Uh, is it hard I, now? I hardly hold hands with people. Is it hard to do now? No, it feels good. Okay, good. Yeah. All right, all right. Now, I don't know who wants, who may want to hug okay. Kathy, but if it, oh, oh, we got a candidate right oh, here. Now, wait a minute. Before you do that, though, <laughs> is it okay with you? Yeah. I mean, do you even know Dorothy? No. Pardon? Okay. Well, well as you, you will. As you will. Mm, thank you. Yeah. Oh, good. <laughs> now, how did that feel? On a scale of zero to ten, was good. there any, any any at all? No, it felt good. Oh, we have Veronica here. Oh, Veronica, yeah. You, you <laughs> understand me? <laughs> Thank you. Yeah, you made me want to do this yesterday. Looks well, good, doesn't it? Yeah, it does. Well, let's go on down. I don't know if we have any more huggers or not, but if not, you and I can hug some. Oh, we have another hugger. Okay. Oh, thank you. Thank you very much. How are you feeling? Good. Do you want me to leave you be and you can just walk down the... Or okay. do you want me to be here? I can do it. Okay. Okay. Suits oh, me. Okay. Well, thank you. Thank you very much. It's all right. I get the last hug, okay? Thank you very much. Thanks a lot. Well, just have a little seat for a second. Okay. I just want to close up on this for a minute, if we can. Um, you may or may not find hugs in the future as easy to do as you just did. Because okay, we yeah, just I can't believe this. Okay. By the way, we, we did no reversal here, did we? No setup. I don't even think we did it once, if I recall it. It wasn't necessary in this case. It just wasn't necessary. Okay. Uh, sometimes that's true. It, so it happened fairly quickly. We didn't have to go through a lot of stuff. We didn't or didn't have to go, go through. So, so you take it as it comes, okay? Now, um, you've had this experience and your anxiety about hugs is reduced, I guess. Yeah. Typically, it's going to be permanent. Now, that doesn't mean when you get home, your children are going to respond to you as they always have because they're used to a mother who doesn't like to be hugged, okay? So you may have to... Except they've all moved away, but... <laughs> okay, well, you, the husband... No. And whoever well, he else, doesn't touch me. Okay, whoever else in your life... Uh, Whoever else in your life, you know, maybe a hug candidate, um, probably need to deal with that because they're not used to you. They're used to you doing this, okay? And they're going to expect you to do that. So you need to deal with that. Some. You're welcome to call me on the phone. Oh, thanks. Uh, as as because you have a son who's a baseball player. Right. Okay. You can do. I'd like to do that as well. Excellent. Okay. I think it could help. Now there are more issues, of course, and there wasn't just the boiling water and just and just the hugs. These are just symptoms of things. But the point is. And your system responds really well to these processes. Um, but now I want, uh, you need to do, remember, I just keep doing it for yourself, I'm what you need to do. Now, uh, I want to ask you a question. Is your mother worth forgiving? Hmm. No, but I'm worth forgiving. <coughs> oh, 